Hey everyone, this is Rachel and welcome to another scrapbooking process video. If you hang out until after the video is through, there are always detailed shots of my current layout. Let's get going! Hey everyone, so today I am working with Simple Stories Summer Vibes, a little bit older collection. I am going to be doing this layout at a crop in November, so I'm just pre-taping all of these to show you what I'm working with. Alright folks, let's get going! All right, so I'm looking through the papers I have left. Now, I happen to have two of these rainbow ombre star sun bursty style papers, so I'm pretty sure I'm going to use that for my background. Now, this particular layout was actually a sketch challenge uh, given by the Crop Hostess, which is, uh, this was Heather's Crafty Life's crop in North Carolina that I went to and had a fabulous time. I mentioned in the beginning that this was this video was taken at a crop. So I have this 5 by 7 photo of my dog Sadie. This photo was not taken by me. It was actually taken by my nephew and uh, he had posted it on Instagram and I asked him to send it to me so I could scrapbook it. I love the photo of her laying in the grass. That's one of her favorite things to do once it starts to get warm outside is, you know, we let her out, out and she does her business and then she just kind of wanders to a grassy area and plops herself down and likes to bake in the sun. So uh, it's going to be a pretty simple layout. I have one uh, multi multicolor, I have one pattern paper matting my photo right now and I'm considering adding a second mat, but instead I decide I'm going to use this uh, scattered polka dot piece as uh, the next layer in my layout, there is a banner layout as part of the sketch. And so I'm just using the handy dandy cut down the middle and then trim from each corner to the center trick to create the banner. If I had, like looking back at it now, I really wish once I did this, I had trimmed the piece and let that banner piece be a little bit longer once I get it behind my photo. In the original sketch, the layout calls for a four by six photo. Obviously I'm using a five by seven, as I mentioned, but I just wish I had uh, cut that behind and had that banner piece come out just a little bit further, but it's completed now, so I'm not going to try to uh, quote unquote, fix it. Now in the sketch, there is a uh, horizontal piece running along the bottom that I believe is probably in Heather's mind, it was a uh, ribbon or I'm not quite sure, but I decide to use this uh, piece of paper and it's from, from one of the pieces that are already pre-decorated, which makes it a very easy thing to deal with. So yay, I'm also adding that doily as you can see. And I'm going ahead and getting my paper down and I put the paper on the bottom piece, realizing I hadn't yet glued down my top piece of paper and that was going to make it awkward to get it all down straight. So I managed to do that and I, I, I'm gobsmacked that I managed to do it straight the first time round. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna go ahead and start with my title. And I'm starting with these wood veneer pieces that have uh, been colored. These came from a hip kit exclusive from a summer kit. I am not a hip kit, kit subscriber. I bought a grab bag and these were in there and it worked out perfectly. The colors matched wonderfully. So the word summer is from, as I said, that wood veneer pack. And then the rest of my title is coming from the Summer Vibes 12 by 12 alpha sticker sheet. Uh, there are two different fonts, or there are four different fonts. Um, I'm going to use the largest and the smallest, and I'm just calling this Sadie in the summer, because as I said, as soon as it gets warm outside, she is all for sunbathing. <laughs> so, and sometimes it's kind of like, okay, oh, well, we actually have to go, so you need to, you know, come inside, and, you know, selective hearing of the schnauzer occurs. Uh, <laughs> so, I, um, 
I'm continuing to embellish. I have from that wood veneer pack those stars and the arrows. And then from the Summer Vibes 12 by 12 icon sticker sheet, I grab this scalloped striped piece of sticker and I'm just going to trim that up so it goes along with the banner. And I'm liking the way that's looking. As I said, because I was following a sketch, it's a pretty simple layout. I decide I'm going to go ahead and just use up all of these stars in a diagonal upper left to lower right direction. And I'm just going to write a little bit of journaling talking about, as I said, Sadie's love of the outdoors in the summertime and just basking in the sun. I'm going to finish it up adding uh, some more of these tile stickers and I'm going to go ahead and add the year. This actually was 2018, so it's pretty. Um, I wanted to, I probably have a couple of other photos of her hanging out in the yard, so I wanted to, and you know, she's the same size as she's been for 15 years now. So I wanted to make sure to get that uh, year in. I am finishing off this layout by adding several of the phrase stickers from the 12 by 12 sticker sheet, and that's going to finish my layout today. Thanks guys for joining me. If you could flick me a thumbs up, that would be great. Um, bye.